And now we move to North Olmsted, where a devastating house fire left a young family homeless. Tonight, the community is rallying, helping to make sure they get what they need. News 5's Emily Hamilton shows how social media is helping to garner support. Their house is... There's not much left salvageable, to be honest. Maura Schuster woke up Thursday to learn that a close friend lost everything in a fire overnight. My mom actually texted me this morning, and she's the one who's like, that's Melissa and Kevin's house. This is all that's left of the family's home after that fire tore through the house Wednesday night. They're now displaced with three children under the age of three just two weeks before Christmas. The couple, who did not feel comfortable speaking on camera, are parents to a two-year-old daughter and foster parents to two babies, one of them just a week old. With three little kids, two new ones, I'm sure they already had Christmas presents, like, and to have everything lost and to feel so hopeless. Schuster took to Facebook to post a list of the essentials, and because of her quick action and compassion, other people started posting right away asking what they could do. Donations of children's clothes, high chairs, baby food, and formula have been pouring in from the North Olmsted community all day. I have a couple kids about the same age as uh, this family, and we were fortunate to have extra things that we ended up never using. I honestly didn't think it would blow up as much as it did. I was actually at work trying to manage the uh, notifications. The American Red Cross is assisting the family whose home was classified as destroyed. Meantime, neighbors say in a year already riddled with emotional and financial stress, there's no better time to give. Middle of winter, Christmas season, it's a lot to deal with. Reporting in North Olmstead, Emily Hamilton, News 5.